Hello, I'm uh, Dr. Vardhan. Uh, I'm from Hassan. Uh, I studied my uh, uh, MBBS in uh, AJ Institute of Medical Science in uh, Mangalore. Basically, I got through, uh, got into the college uh, through uh, NEET. It was during 2016-17 uh, uh, batch. And uh, yeah, talking about the college, uh, it's a huge campus, uh, I would say. Uh, hospital and uh, the medical college is situated uh, nearby. And uh, also hospital facilities are also being given by the college itself and it's also nearby to the medical college. Uh, what I'd say about the hostel facility is that uh, uh, it's a, it's a, uh, what I've heard from my friends through in other colleges is that uh, our hostel is a, a pretty uh, well uh, accommodated hostel, uh, I'd say. They have uh, AC rooms along with uh, uh, two, uh, two occupant uh, uh, rooms. And uh, I would say, uh, what I'd say about the uh, campus per se is uh, they have uh, cafeterias, uh, a, a playground, a basketball ground and a, a football ground and then uh, staff, quarter, staff quarters and then uh, a huge parking space, everything is available within the campus itself. And uh, uh, from what I'd say, uh, uh, from my first year, uh, I was pretty nervous actually. I mean, uh, to get into the MBBS, you know, how the hype would be. Uh, but uh, the teachers are very friendly. First year, uh, they, I had anatomy, uh, biochemistry and physiology. Anatomy, as, as all of you know, uh, there'll be uh, dissection classes and uh, 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 histology classes uh, as well. So they have a lot of, uh, uh, you know, uh, in hand, like they, they take, uh, uh, they, they take uh, individual care uh, while during dissection classes. They had uh, uh, they had us divided into six groups where uh, they, where each uh, faculty will be put into uh, one group and also uh, they will be given uh, uh, weekly tests where uh, we can improvise our uh, uh, syllabus as well. I mean, our uh, we we can keep in check to our studies as well. Uh, that is what anatomy uh, was of. And uh, uh, biochemistry uh, biochemistry I'd say they have a good lab facility too. And uh, the classes will be uh, t taken in a huge uh, 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 auditorium. With uh, also there be there there was uh, a weekly test weekly test so that we could keep on keep on checking up to our day to day to day studies. And also uh, physiology physiology we had uh, efficient teachers. Uh, and uh, coming to se uh, second year uh, we ha I had uh, pathology uh, microbiology f uh, forensic medicine and uh, pharmacology. So all of them uh, were uh, well versed too and uh, there is a separate uh, pharmacovigilance, uh, uh, if I talk about pharmacology, uh, our, uh, one, of our, one of our uh, professor was the head of pharmacovigilance society of uh, India. So we had a pretty good exposure as well uh, and uh, uh, coming to uh, third year uh, I had uh, community medicine, uh, ENT and ophthalmology. Community medicine, we uh, uh, AJ uh, had uh, one urban health center uh, in Kavur, it's in uh, Mangalore. It's, it's around uh, five to six kilometers from uh, uh, Mangalore. So we were posted there, uh, and we were uh, we were uh, asked to uh, go on for house visits uh, to take cases from uh, uh, in and around the village areas. Uh, and coming to ENT and ophthalmology, we had very good clinical exposure. That, that's that's when you get a clinical exposure and uh, take cases and uh, interact through interact to uh, patients. Uh, coming to fourth year, uh, fourth year uh, there was uh, general surgery, uh, general medicine, uh, pediatrics, and uh, uh, OBG. So AJ uh, had a pretty uh, not not I would not say a good amount of uh, case loads, but uh, you know you can uh, you can push through. That's what I would say. Uh, and also, uh, uh, sometimes there will be a, a, a very low amount of cases, but uh, you can, you, you, if you are interested, you can uh, uh, go and uh, take cases uh, after the classes also. So, and uh, coming to uh, finally, it's, it's an important stage, and uh, all of our HODs are uh, also uh, well known, so that uh, they uh, they take uh, good care uh, too. Uh, coming to internship, uh, internship was uh, my with my experience. I I was uh, into a surgical field, so I had got a pretty good exposure of suturing, dressings, and uh, emergency care uh, as well. Uh, uh, so uh, internship, uh, we were posted in a rural setup, which, which is uh, situated in a uh, situated around uh, 15 kilometers from Mangalore. So there we uh, we uh, had worked in a uh, uh, government taluk hospital. So we will be posted there for three months. 
so in the uh, during that time you you will know because you you are, you will be the head of the uh, hospital so you uh, you you'll know how to deal with patients and how to uh, uh, get along with patients so and uh, uh, talking about extracurricular activities in our college uh, there is a pretty good exposure. Uh, me, uh, I myself represented my college for uh, state uh, state level cricket uh, 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 tournament. So we are, we had won a lot of tournaments, and also if you check through the uh, internet, we you you will come across uh, our co college winning a lot of uh, uh, tournaments as well, like uh, state uh, inter university interzonals, zonals, uh, everything like that. So if you are if you are a sport into you you can obviously choose the college. And talking about uh, cafeterias. Uh, I'd say they have uh, they have their own uh, uh, what I'd say is they have their own company uh, uh, set up in like it's, it's called Moti Mall. Uh, it's our uh, head of the institute uh, uh, set up. So we'll be getting food from there itself. Uh, and uh, yeah, about uh, the mess food, uh, whoever uh, is interested in joining a uh, uh, hostel, uh, I'd say uh, there is an alternate for non vegetarians. I'd say there's an alternate uh, day uh, non vegetarian uh, uh, non veg available. And then, um, so you'll uh, it's 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 typical uh, Mangalore style food. The, what they prepare, so you'll uh, get along with that.